Left-wing anarchists are usually referred to as simply anarchists, whereas right-wing anarchists are called anarcho-capitalists. They have one important thing in common, the fact that they oppose the state and want a stateless society. However, that's pretty much where the similarities end. Anarcho-capitalists, for the most part, adhere to the Austrian school of economic thinking and envision a society governed by voluntary trade on free markets. Capitalism on steroids, if you will. Anarchists, however, see things differently because, unlike anarcho-capitalists, they don't just oppose the state. Instead, they opposed any hierarchy-based social order and therefore consider capitalism as bad as the state. To give you two examples. One, if Mike owns a house and John voluntarily pays him rent to live there, anarcho-capitalists would say this is simply the free market working and therefore perfectly acceptable. Anarchists, however, would point out the hierarchy of it all, so people who own homes on the one hand and those who don't on the other. Two, if Mike owns a factory and John agrees to work there, then once again anarcho-capitalists would see this as a voluntary transaction. Anarchists, on the other hand, would point out the hierarchical aspect, seeing a class conflict between employers and employees. All in all, anarchists basically consider capitalism a form of privatized statism and therefore undesirable. Their main goal is moving on to a system in which hierarchy plays as small of a role as possible. Anarcho-capitalists, on the other hand, argue that for the society envisioned by anarchists, massive redistribution of wealth would be required and that in the end, we'd once again have a state that supervises it all. What's your position? 